What is up guys and welcome back to my channel here with the fresh and wavy content. Today's video is going to be a reaction of Blackpink Feet Selena Gomez ice cream. When I tell you guys I've been looking forward to this all week, generally speaking, I don't know what this video is going to give me. I don't know whether I'm going to be able to breathe throughout this video. Who would have thought Blackpink and Selena Gomez would collaborate? Not me, not I. <laughs> really excited to see how they're going to be able to collaborate on this track, how the sound is going to be, and also the rap line. What are they going to give me? Because when it comes to the rap line, I get extra, extra, extra gas, okay? I start feeling my stuff. I start pointing directions I should be pointing at. I start feeling like... I don't know how I'm going to cope for its reaction, so if I keep on pausing, just know it's for a reason. Just know that after every pause, there's a legitimate statement that's about to come. You just have to wait for it, alright? Now, this is kind of my second reaction ever on the channel, so I'm still getting used to, like, the reaction lifestyle. It's just not a bit of me, but soon, it will be a bit of me. Just stay tuned. If you end up enjoying this reaction, smash the like button, subscribe if you're new here, because... Um, <clears throat> we may or may not be so close to 10k subscribers and that's absolutely insane. We just started this channel this week. Thank you so much for saying so much. Bitch, what did I just say? Thank you so much for saying. <clears throat> Am I that excited for this? Ah! Thank you so much for so. Thank you so. <laughs> um, ciao. Anyway, so. Selena Gomez and Blackpink have me moving mad this morning. Like, it's literally 8 in the morning and they have me moving mad. Thank you so much for showing so much support. And let's just get started. You know what? I've been waiting all week for this, but I don't think I've actually mentally prepared for it because it's here now. The video is here. Everything's here. I just need to be here. <laughs> so excited to see the visuals, to see how they're going to literally collaborate in terms of sound. I'm excited to see who's going to be placed where in a song because that's really important to me. When it came to reacting to BTS the other day, BTS Dynamite, I like the song, I just wasn't happy with the arrangement and I'm always so vocal if there's something a little bit off to me or something could be changed. Bitch, I'm here to tell you the truth, all right? I'm not gonna show come and be like, oh my God, yes, yes. If it isn't, yes, yes. You get realness over here, just appreciate that. Why is there an ad? There's a flipping ad that you can't skip. Is that how you guys feel when you watch my videos? Why is it that kind of ad? Wait, I can skip it. There we go. I'm excited, let's do this. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Visuals. K-pop artists, bands, I don't care who you is, anything related to K-pop is always visual related. This is clearer than 1080p. What do you, what, why do you need something clearer than 1080p? That's already clear. This is giving, I can literally see skin, glass, skin, like, you can never catch them lacking or slacking. It's just not them. That is not in their vocabulary. It's not. Lisa. This hairstyle, this haircut, love it. The black and pink and the purples, I'm feeling it so much. Oh my god, they're already gonna wreck me. And how many seconds? We're only f f four seconds out of a three minute video. Oh god, you gotta pray for me down below in the comment section. Like, literally, oh. nah, I've got to get into this. This whole skin thing, yeah, I thought my skin was somewhat decent. When I look at them lots, oh, oh no, Keisha, you gotta go. Bye bye. Their skin is always on fleek. Oh. I don't think I'm ready for this. I'm not ready for this. I'm not. Let's continue. Jesus. They genuinely look so cute. I'm sorry, I'm pausing. Oh my god, is this like a light purple moment? Oh my god, their makeup is like so... They will never give you beat look. I think I'd want to see them like beat makeup one day, like a lot of heavy face of makeup. That would be sickening too. But for the most part, they always give you like natural, at most, like a nice little, you know, pastel color in the crease. Girl, I'm not a makeup artist, let me shut up. Selena. Selena. Selena flipping Gomez. SG. Miss SG, let's talk real quickly. <laughs> This outfit that I've been seeing on Instagram the whole week because I've been dropping teasers here and there. This outfit I need to get into. This is like a new look for Sydney Gomez. I don't think I've ever seen her really. No, I've never seen her in an outfit like this before. I'm excited to see what she's going to give me as well. So let's continue on. But so far, the visuals look aesthetically pleasing. The colors are popping. The song is called Ice Cream. We can obviously the, see the ice cream shape thingy majiggy. I'm so bad at explaining things, but you can see it on the screen. grown up now you guys saw me on disney channel i was a little girl i was a little teenager oh i'm a grown-ass woman now i'm an adult are you not deep in the <laughs> yes we love a good sis that's all grown up now we love it when it comes to Selena gomez 
like no shade at all, but I kind of felt like out of all the Disney girls who've been making music, or even the Nickelodeon girls, I felt like she was one of the very few that took a bit longer to grow up. And maybe it was because she felt obligated to, you know, act a certain way or appear a certain way. But she's a very mature lady and I respect that and I love that specifically about her. But when it comes to this whole music thing, I felt like it only took a couple of years ago for her to really mature with the audience. I felt like she was still making no shade but kitty bops. And I still enjoy the kitty bops. Girl, it's on my playlist. So, I mean, again, no shade, but I'm happy to see her like just say it as it is and just if it's you, it's you. If it's not you, it's not a bit of you, you know? Let's continue. <laughs> what just happened? I li Hold on, we need to rewind it. That just happened too fast. Everything's ha I like the little kick up moment, all of them. That's <laughs> I might need to join the band. I might have to be the first person, the first black K pop artist. I mean, girl, <laughs> girl, I wouldn't mind at this point. They all look so good. Okay, let's continue. This song is really sexual. I'm sure you guys have gathered from the lyrics already. It's just like, bitch, I'm here to talk about it, and I'm not mad at this. This is, this is, I'm, I'm excited to see the chorus though, because the lyrics so far are just ice cream related, but in a very explicit way. And you know what, we love somebody who can make profits off of talking about food, but in general it's talking about, you know what, so. Wait a second, did she say play the part like Moses? If you get that line, comment down below. Only real people would, not real people, let me not be shady, but only the real can relate. Like, if you know about that line, comment down below. If, if you know the reference of, there's no way she said that though. I can't remember. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I'm, 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 I'm digging Selena Gomez's appearance in this video. I'm digging it. Like, I'm, I'm actually digging it. Now, as for the lyrics, obviously it could be better, but they are re referencing an ice cream, and I'm sure that the target with this specific song was for like the younger viewer. Actually, no, I imagine it's the older viewers, but it's the appearance-wise, younger viewers, if that makes sense. All right, so far though, realistically, I'm preferring Selena Gomez's part. I'm, I'm preferring her part. So far, I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just more fitting for her. I don't know. So far, I'm kind of no shade expecting a bit more from Blackpink, but we're only even less than one minute into this, so who knows whether it's going to progress or not. Selena Gomez like looks different, like she looks extra, extra, extra snatched. Love that for her. We love a good, healthy, snatched moment. We do. Nah, Selena, nah, Selena Gomez has not aged one bit. I remember watching this girl on Disney Channel with the family, and we were like, oh my gosh, she's cute. She looks exactly the same. Like, she does not, not one wrinkle in sight. How? Lord, I pray I get to that level of I can look the exact same age as I do right now, the age of 20. By the age of 40, I don't want any creases. Mm -mm. I don't want that. I don't want that. It's not, it's not, it's not in my plan. It's not what I have planned for myself, you know? But so far, Selena Gomez, in my personal opinion, is killing it just a tad bit more. I mean, obviously the girls are doing their thing, they're strutting around, they look good. I think so far, if anything, have been gassed with Lisa's part. I like that section, but I don't know, I'm suspecting a tad bit more, but let's keep on watching anyways. <laughs> I love how they're definitely going in this more mature route though, definitely. That's tough! <laughs> okay, when, okay, new outfits, let's see what it's giving you. Lisa and this bob moment with the fringe and the colors. I'm living for this hair color. This green look, it would not suit a regular Degla Schmegler person. You can try it, but it won't look cute. But on her, I'm 10 out of 10. 
Yes, Selena. Selena Gomez is feeling herself. And I like that. I love to see an artist feel themselves while they are on set because I feel like it makes the video a million times better than somebody just standing there like a stale piece of bread. I think I said this before on like a video, I can't remember which one, but like I just love to see someone feel themselves. It makes the video 10 times better. Selena Gomez doing that little, I like that, I like that. The mini choreography. I like that choreography. It's giving me um, Ariana Grande. What song is it? Greedy, I think. Yeah. yeah. Is it Greedy? I'm not sure what choreography is giving me, but I love that little flick of the wrist. That's sick. Alright, now as for the chorus part, I'm not really that happy with it. I mean, I know the song's called Ice Cream. I don't know. I think I'm going to save my thoughts and opinions till the end. Let's just continue. Ice cream, chillin', chillin', ice cream. Chillin' like a villain, yeah, rah, rah, rah. Nitsy, nitsy, get down, soak the wind, my life, rah. Nah, Lisa, Lisa. Ice cream, chillin', Lisa. Lisa will be the death of me. Lisa's wrecking me. I'm so sorry. All these hairstyles, these outfit changes. This is probably my favorite one. This one and the green one just now. Mona Lisa, Lisa, I do want to say that I love the wardrobe of this whole video. Like, I love the outfits everyone's wearing. Here are my honest thoughts and opinions. Visuals, 10 out of 10, couldn't have changed it, it's great. I mean, the song is called Ice Cream, so I kind of expected the song to not be of anything, in some ways, meaningful, if that makes sense. I feel like it's more so a kiddie bop. I think kids will probably just listen to it without actually knowing the actual meaning, and then when they grow up, they'll be like, oh my god, okay, Blackpink meant that, Selena Gomez meant that, oh. <laughs> Wardrobe stylist, they got it on point. Selena Gomez looks absolutely stunning. She just looks healthy, glowing, glistening, love that. Little by little, she's getting her confidence back. That's what it appears like anyways from just watching this video. As for Blackpink, the, the first half for me was a little bit underwhelming. I think maybe going into this, I had high expectations and just seeing like sneak peeks on their social medias and stuff. I was just kind of like, okay, this is lit. And it still is great, don't get me wrong. Maybe going to this with high expectations wasn't the best thing to do. And that's a lesson on my half learned. First half for me was a little bit underwhelming. I feel like Selena Gomez kind of carried it for me. And then we get into the second half where things kind of pick up. And then we had the rap lines, which get me gas all the time lisa killed this video for sure i think it's meant to be like a summer song anyway so a perfect time to drop it even though it's literally felt like winter here in london during august i think i'm gonna rate this song and then the music video so the music video for me is like a 8.5 i want to say because i have to be fair here because obviously things could have been better all right but i think out of the condition and situation that, that we're in in this world that we just had to have shot things that way that's like a lot of artists who've been releasing during lockdowns like i love the song so much but if the visuals were better it would give it a 10 immediately but of course due to things going on in the world it just can't go about that way so i understand that the song i would probably give a 7 or 7.5 that's a good number i'm not going to change it nothing less nothing more than that comment down below your ratings of the song as well as the visuals too i think in the next reaction whatever it is i'm not going to go into it with high expectations i'm just going to like you know just relax calm down not be too hyped even if they're like my faves that's much of today's reaction i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did again smash the like button subscribe down below as we are close to 10k and yes i'll see you guys very soon bye